Companies are dealing with getting employees back into the office, but the Delta variant now already unraveling some plans and forcing a U-turn in other places. ABC's Deirdre Bolton has more. The New York Times, Google, Facebook, Twitter, Uber, Lyft, and Apple all delaying a return to the office due to the Delta variant. This version of the virus, the Delta variant, uh, it's as or more contagious than chickenpox. The chief executive of the New York Times company wrote in an email to staff on Friday that the company is, quote, not ready to specify a new date for a full reopening, adding that employees would have at least four weeks notice before the return ask. All of employers are, are getting together, scratching their heads, uh, trying to come up with uh, the solution. For many workers, they remain in limbo, adding stress to what has already been a difficult year and a half. You're going from Zoom to Zoom to Zoom, and then you're going straight into household duties. There just aren't that many breaks anymore between the workday and the home life. During this time, one expert says companies with good leadership embrace one key concept. Clarity. Clarity of policy, clarity, clarity of support, clarity of things to support people in the home environment. For some, remote work is working for them. I don't have the long commute. I've replaced that commute with having more bonding time with my children. I'm not spending endless amount of time looking for parking. I can get the work done. I feel that I've proven that I can, I can be highly effective as a remote worker. To that end, advice for workers who do not want to go back to the office full time whenever those offices do reopen. There's really three key steps to think about. The first is, have an open and honest conversation with your boss or your manager. Let them know how you are, how you're feeling. Number two, let them understand the why. I think the stigma has gone away in terms of, you know, working from home. And then the other thing is make sure that your contributions are known and that they're valuable. Disney, the parent company of ABC News, is delaying its return in order to give time to employees to be fully vaccinated. As a final point in these trying times, or maybe because of them, experts say the war for talent is real and companies that lead with empathy will hold on to their stars. Eva? Deirdre Bolton for us there. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.